All right, all you beautiful people, welcome back to the channel. I stand alone gaming. Welcome back to our Final Fantasy X series or Final Fantasy X. We left off after we found something resembling an airship, or so they said. Um, we did a few other things, talked to Orin, <clears throat> and uh, Orin kind of blindsided us with being abducted by Sin's butthole. But other than that, we're ready to get going. All we gotta do, I think, is talk to Riku. You said... You play Blitzball? Uh-huh. You know, you should go to Luca. Someone might know who you are, or you might find someone you recognize. Luca? Ah. Uh. Huh. Okay, leave it to me. I'll get you to Luca. Promise. Uh, you'd rather stay here? Uh-uh. Okay, I'll go tell the others. Wait here. Oh, and one thing. Don't tell anyone you're from Xanarkand, okay? Yevon says it's a holy place. You might upset someone. Oh, uh-huh. Xanarkand? Some kind of holy place? <laughs> yeah, right, I thought. Since when? Yevon? Sin? Luca? I thought Sin just took me to a faraway place that I could go back in a day or two. But a thousand years into the future? No way! Blitzball! Hey, you okay? Hey! All right, so Sin's butthole strikes again, and now we're stranded on a, looks like tropical island. So first thing you want to do is come over here. I usually grab this chest first because I can forget it later. There's one other chest in this area, but we won't worry about that till later in the game. And all you got to do is walk over to Waka. Yo. Hiya. Uh, you want 
gonna try that move one more time. Finally, things were starting to look up. Forget that. Uh, I got too uh, close to sin, and my head's all foggy like. So uh, I don't know where this place is, or even where I came from. Sin's toxin got to you, but you're still alive. Praise be to Yevon. All right, back to practice. I'm Waka. Coach and captain of the Besaid Aurox, brother. <laughs> what? You hungry? Okay, back to the village. I'll get you something. All right. And this starts our journey back to the village. I felt like I could trust this Waka, so I just had to ask. Um, it's true Xanarkin was destroyed right a thousand years ago so it's just a big pile of rubble now isn't it long time ago there were a whole lot of cities in spira big cities with machina machines to run them people played all day and let the machina do the work and then well take a look sin came and destroyed the machina cities and xanarkand along with them yeah, that was about a thousand years ago, just like you said. If you ask me, sin's our punishment for letting things get out of hand. What gets me, though, is we gotta suffer because of what some goofballs did way back when. Of course, we must always repent for our sins. That's important. It's just that it's hard to keep at it sometimes, you know? It was just as Riku said. Waka and Riku couldn't both be lying. Why would they? <laughs> but you from the Xanarkand Daves, that was a good one, huh? Hey, I'm not saying the team never existed, yeah? <laughs> but you gotta figure, a team living in luxury like that be pretty soft, eh? I appreciated the fact that Waka was trying to cheer me up. But at that time, all I could think about was everything that happened to me. All this started with sin. Maybe if I could find Sin one more time, I could go home. For now, I'd just live life until that time came. No more worrying about where or when I was. Sure, it was hard not to think of home, but I started to feel better already. A little better. Maybe. Alright, so we gotta save through there, but we already saved it. So we're just gonna follow hey, Waka. There's about <clears throat> three chests in this water. Uh, I don't exactly remember exactly where they are, but I do think there's three. There's one right here. I always thought it was pretty cool that Waka attacks with his blitz ball.
So you can farm some fights here if you like. Uh, I'm not going to. I save that for a little bit later. Pretty much like right before I get off the island. So I'll let you know when that is. Just because there's a little bit harder of monsters. So. This is the last chest, and then we can travel to the Red Arrow. Certainly picking on Titus here. Coming up, all the teams in Spira will be there. It's so huge, I'm sure someone there will recognize you. Then you can go back to your old team, right? It'll be fun. What do you say, huh? Come on, come on. Sure thing. Dude, our team is gonna rock, eh? I thought then that Blitzball and Sin were the only two things that Spira and Xanarkin had in common. I wasn't too far off either. This is where I was born. I started Blitz when I was five. I joined the Aurochs at 13, 10 years ago. 10 years, and we never won a game. Well, after last year's tournament, I quit. Time seemed right. So, after quitting, I got this new job, yeah? But every time my mind wandered, I thought about the game. Ten years without a single win will do that. Hmm. My first match last year was my big chance. But something else was on my mind. I couldn't focus. Nice excuse. Hey, hey! So, you want to win the next tournament? Go out with a bang. So, what's our goal? I don't care how we do. As long as we play our best. If we give it our all, I can walk away happy. Uh, no, 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 no. If I say, what's our goal? You say victory! When you play in a Blitzball tournament, you play to win. Victory? You're serious? Fuck yeah. Victory! <clears throat> so you just walk down this path. Ah, the one from the sea. Be on guard. There are fiends on the road today. After surviving your run-in with Sin, it would be a shame if something happened now. Who are they? 
Luzu and Gata, Crusaders. Huh? Cruise of what? What? You forgot that too? Hey, sorry. Don't worry about it. I'll help you out. Cool. In return, come tournament time, I'll make sure we take the cup. Cool. About the Crusaders, you can ask them yourself. They got a lodge in the village. Cruiser, what now? Ain't nobody told me no prayers. What is this nonsense? So, first thing you want to do, chest here. Come down to the left here. Three more chests. And I believe that is all the chests in this area. Let me check these two houses real quick. But I'm fairly certain those are the only ones. Yep, seems like it. So with that being said, let's go ahead and check out the Crusaders Lounge over here. We got our Albed book number two. So now we have A and B, and then we talk to these guys. Hey, you! You were attacked by Sin, right? Recently, was it? I think so. So, Sin can't be far, right? You're not hiding anything, are you? Why would I? If Sin's nearby, it'll attack the island for sure. But it hasn't. I wonder why. I'm sorry, I really don't know anything. To tell the truth, I uh, don't even know what the Crusaders are. You're kidding, right? Sin, the toxin. Gotta tell him who we are. Yes, sir. The Crusaders are sworn to battle Sin. We have chapters throughout Spira, accepting all who wish to join our struggle. The hero Meehan formed the Crusaders 800 years ago as the Crimson Blades. Later, our ranks grew and we called ourselves the Crusaders. We've been fighting sin ever since. What? You've been fighting 800 years and you still haven't beat it? Uh, uh, uh. Well, we've steered sin away from towns many times. And that's all we can do. Nobody's ever been able to defeat it. Our mission as Crusaders is to protect the temples, towns, villages, and people of Spira. So, then whose job is it to defeat sin? Is Sin's toxin really this bad, sir? It does seem rather bad. We could just tell you, but I think it better for you to try and remember. Go pray at the temple. Perhaps Yevon will help you regain your memory. All right. 
So one more thing before we leave. Let's go ahead and toss a save in. It's a very long game, and uh, you definitely want to save as much as possible. It only takes you one time for something to happen or your game to freeze for you to be like, man, I really should have saved three hours ago. So save as much as you can. standing in that place. I began to realize how different this world was from my own. became High Summoner. And finally, we receive a statue for our temple. Oh, what's a High Summoner? <gasps> uh, uh, I, I got too close to Sin's uh, toxin. It was funny hearing myself make the same excuse over and over. Funny, and a little sad. The summoners are practitioners of a sacred art, sworn to protect the people of Yevon. Only a chosen few become summoners, who call forth entities of great power, the Aeons. The Aeons hear our prayers and come down to us. They are the blessing of Yevon. So what he meant was that we should respect some kind of great men or something like that, I figured. Slowly getting more and more backstory as we continue along. So we came to check this place out. I don't think there's any chests in here. We come back out. Waka, my main man. What do I do next? Sorry, man. No time for lunch yet. Take a nap. You look pushed. Sure. You could at least go see how they are doing. We can't interfere. It's a rule. But it's been nearly... But, but, but it's been nearly. It's been nearly a day already. Perhaps you could go look for us. People are searching for him now. Thank you. Who cares whether he comes back or not? But he might die. Fine, let him. Do you... Do you hate him so? But if he dies, you'll never be able to tell him how much you hate him. Oh, my me. Sleeping in on the job. So, we're gonna go look for Waka now. Spoiler alert, I don't know which way to go.
Baka. Is something wrong? The summoner hasn't returned from the trial. Eh? Well, apprentice summoner, really. Uh. There's a room in there called the Cloister of Trials. Beyond is where the apprentice summoner prays. If the prayer is heard, the apprentice becomes a fully fledged summoner. Remember? Uh, so someone is in there somewhere and they haven't come back out. Right, I got it. A day's already gone by. Is it particularly dangerous in there? Sometimes, yes. Why don't you go in and help? There's already guardians in there. Besides, it's forbidden. Hey, but what if something happens? What if the summoner dies? The precepts must be obeyed. Like I care. Naughty, naughty, naughty. This wasn't such a good idea after all. This gives you a little bit of a rundown of the Cloister of Trials. This pretty much appears before any time, uh, without giving too much away, it pretty much appears any time you lose Yuna from your party. <laughs> the first thing you want to do is touch the emblem. Touch this emblem. We want to pick up this bad boy. Place it in the door. Door opens. I can go ahead and take this. Actually, I think we're gonna leave this here for now. Push in a little bit further. Oh no, we did have to take it. Silly me. I think we put it in this side. Touch some more symbols. Magic. It's gonna tell you what to do with the pillar. Pedestal. We're not gonna do that yet. Come back out here to the store we opened. We got a destruction sphere. And this puppy goes in over here. Now every Cloister of Trials, uh, as far as I know, has a Destruction Sphere in it. And it also gives you a chest if you use it, so... It's like a little bonus, so make sure that you're doing that anytime you visit a Cloister of Trials. And now we just move the pedestal. Apprentice summoners and their guardians can enter here. It's a tradition, very important. 
So what about you? Me? I'm a guardian. A guardian? Summoners go on a pilgrimage to pray at every temple in Spira. Guardians protect them. The Guardian's in there now. One of them's got a sure fuse, and who knows what the other's thinking. Well, now that we've come this far, might as well go all the way. What are you doing here? Didn't think we'd be able to handle it? No, it's, uh, it's just... See, I told you she gets mad easy. I is the summoner all right? <sighs> Who are you? Man, was I surprised. And here I was thinking summoners were all old geezers. All right, so I don't know why they couldn't just take us, but now we just follow everybody outside. Hey, over here! Over yonder! I had never seen anything like it in my life. Sure, it was a little scary, but still, I could feel a strange kind of gentleness coming from it.
All right, then we got our first Aeon. So I'm gonna change his name, just because it's fun. I'm sure y'all get a laugh out of this. We're gonna name him... Flaccid. If you don't know what it is, look it up. <laughs> I remember that night we talked for the first time. I didn't know it then, but after that night, everything changed. For everyone. For me. Let me introduce you to the team. This guy here wants into the tournament so bad, I let him on the team. His memory's a little fuzzy, so don't mind him if he says anything odd. Come on, say hi. Uh, hi guys. Hi. So what's our goal? To do our best! Nope, we got a new goal now. Our new goal is victory! To win every match, defeat every opposing team, to bring the Crystal Cup back to our island. That's all we need to do to win. Easy, huh? All right, more victory. You heathen! Stay away from the summoner! You're a bad man! They hate Lady me. Yuna, be careful. But it was really my fault to begin with. Oh, oh, oh. I'm Yuna. Thank you so much for your help earlier. Huh? Uh, I'm sorry about that. Wasn't that... Wasn't I not supposed to... Guess I kind of overreacted. Oh, no. I was overconfident. Um, I saw that Aeon thing. That's amazing. Uh, really? Do you think I can become High Summoner? Lady Yuna, come play with me some more. So, tomorrow then. Tomorrow? We're going on the same boat, aren't we? Oh, really? We can talk more. Huh. You can tell me all about Xanarkand. She's cute, yeah? Don't get no ideas. No promises there, big guy. Hey, but what if she, like, comes on to me? That's not going to happen. If you get tired, let me know. I had a bed made for you. All right, so I think we have everything else completed. So I think pretty much all we have to do is talk to Waka. Yeah, we can't even go anywhere else, so Waka it is. Mm. Good. Sleep tight. Where's that boat? Everyone will find us if it doesn't come soon. You really sure this is okay? Would you take me to Xanarkand? Hey! You said you'd go with me! No, 
Oh, hey, I, I uh, uh... I thought Waka told, told you not to get any ideas. ideas. He did? Uh... Yeah, yeah, so you're, you're coming, coming with, with me. me. Hey, stop dreaming! You with a woman? You can't even catch a ball! Oh, what's the matter? Gonna cry again, cry, cry. That's the only thing you're good for. I hate you. Huh? What'd you say? You have to speak loudly. I hate you! Huh? That's the spirit. You can do it. I hate you! He's dead, okay? Dead. He does look a lot like Chapu. I was surprised, too, the first time I saw him. But no matter what he looks like, he isn't Chapu. You shouldn't have brought him here in the first place. Yeah, but he needed our help. Excuses again? Yeah, but... That's it. No more. Enough, Waka. Who's Chapu? My little brother, Chapu. He looked like you. He's dead? He was with the Crusaders when they fought Sin last year. He didn't make it. I first heard on the day of the tournament. Oh, so that's why. I became a guardian to fight Sin, yeah? Revenge, then? That was the idea. <laughs> I'm more worried about a stupid game now than avenging my brother. Well, after the next tournament, I'll be a guardian full-time. I know it kind of looks like I'm using you, but I'm not. Don't worry. I mean, I owe you a lot. You really help me out, you know? What I mean is... Thanks, Waka. <laughs> Stop. You're embarrassing me. Sleeping on the job yet again. Let's go ahead and save it after all that dialogue. outside hey sleepyhead something I want to give you whoa you're giving this to me yeah use it well that's the sword you gave Chapu well he never used it where's Yuna we're taking the same boat as Yuna, right? Why do we gotta wait here? Yuna came to this village ten years ago, when the last calm started. The calm? Since then, she's been like a little sister to me and Lulu. But she had the talent. She became an apprentice. Now, today, she leaves as a summoner. This is our journey. We should leave together. don't need all that luggage. Uh, they're not really my things. Th they're gifts for the temples we're to visit. This isn't a vacation, you know. I guess... I guess you're right. Okay, off we go.
All right, now we got everybody in our group. We got Yuna, Lulu, Waka, and Titus. And the first couple of battles are kind of like um, tutorials on how to use your new characters. Bow! I always thought that sword looked really cool. Not too shabby. You kept up with him pretty well. Might make a good guardian someday. A flyer, my kind of customer. Who invited you? Am I the only one that notices he throws around blue balls all day? Poor Waka. Never gets any from Lulu. That looks like trouble. Ha, watch this. Told you. Only magic can beat that thing. If you can't beat them down, you gotta use magic of an element they don't like. Magic? Element? Let's have our black mage show you what I mean. Lou, you're up. Clueless, aren't you? Good thing I'm here. Spells of ice work well against fire fiends. And ice fiends are weak against fire magic. You follow? I get fire and ice, but what about lightning and water? Lightning and water are opposed, just like fire and ice. This one here is a water fiend, which means... Which means you couldn't spell it out for me? Thunder. Bzzzt. A little bit of thunder, a little bit of lightning. All right, I think there's two or three more like tutorial battles. Take your time. Let's get going, man. We're gonna wait. Huh? Are you ready? <laughs> What's go? It's an ancient custom. People leaving the island pray here for a safe trip. Chapu didn't pray that day. Said he'd miss his boat. That should do it. All right, now we prayed. Let's go ahead and toss another save in. You're gonna be seeing me save a lot. I've had too many files go corrupt or my game freeze or some other stuff going on. So angry. Let's go ahead and attack. We should have gotten um, his cheer abilities already. I should have went through my spear grid and got that. Would have helped us out in this fight. But it's not super difficult. Just go ahead and keep attacking. Once you start getting yellow, go ahead and use a potion. Go 
Go to thought, kitty. Uh, what's with that guy? Kimari Ronso, of the Ronso tribe. He's learned the fiend's way of fighting. That's not what I meant. He's another Yuna's guardians. Huh? <laughs> Sometimes we don't understand him either. Kamari doesn't talk much anyway. Mm. But he has protected me since I was a child. Huh. No kitty, my papa. So you just keep running around. I think, like I said before, there's, I think, one or two more tutorial battles. Maybe three. Ooh, he's ugly. A flyer. That's your department, right? True, true. But, uh, why don't we let our summoner show us what she's made of? Show us what your training has taught you, Yuna. Okay. I gotta do is go to summon. Summon Flaccid. Got a bunch of skills to use. Sonic Wings is pretty good if you can find an enemy that's not immune to it. Basically what it does is it delays the opponent's turn. He also has magic, so you can go ahead and cast one of these on him if you want. But for the most part, you just need to attack, really. So before I get too far, I forgot something back at the town. So I'm going to go ahead and run back. And I'll see you guys in a few minutes. I'll just edit the video. Alright, so before you start making your way out of town, you want to make sure that you run back into Besaid Village. For one reason and one reason only. Go ahead and talk to the shopkeeper in here. You don't need to buy or sell anything. You can just go ahead and hit leave. She's going to say come back soon. And then this is what you're looking for. You know, a funny thing happened. My dog dug something up yesterday. I wonder what it was. So that's kind of like a little hint for what you're looking for. So I'll tell you exactly where it is. Her dog is in here. Oh, hey, cute little puppy. Let me pet you. Got something in his mouth. And just like that, Flaccid learned an overdrive move called Energy Blast. And Flaccid is the only one that can learn a second overdrive. So... I know his real name is Valfor, but I'm going to call him Flaccid as much as possible. So with that being said, that is the only item that we needed here. So we're going to go back to where we were uh, doing the training for the battles. All right, and now that we're back, all we got to do is keep running towards the dock or the beach. And eventually we'll get into another battle like that. And they're going to train us again. One to me, yeah? 
huh? Say good night, buddy. So we're going ahead to use Dark Attack. This blinds the bird for three turns, making it much less likely to hit us. We can go ahead and attack with Lulu, Thunder. We're going to use Yuna to attack just once. And then we're going to swap her back out for Titus. Reason being is the um, as long as your character got one turn in on the fight, they get experience. Go ahead and finish this guy off. He's got one more turn where he's blind. And just like that, he's gone. Keep getting weapons. Alright, so I think now, yep, we're not doing any more tutorial battles. These are all random uh, fights, so you get random encounters now after that last uh, fight. Another weapon, jeez. Weapons for days. Alright guys, so this is the end here. So what I'm going to do after uh, this video is I'm going to go back and do a bunch of random encounters and get some uh, sphere levels. So I think I'm probably going to get about five. So I'm just going to go ahead and grind a bunch of those. But with that being said, this is a good place to leave off on this episode. So I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, please leave a like on the video. Uh, I really hope you did enjoy it. Thank you for giving me your time. Thank you for watching. I really hope to see you in the next video. And take care.